be going. So these cars have uh, a. She, she really go get her purse really quick because she won't be able to get back in. Sure, she will. Those doors aren't locked. Okay. Wait, where is Robbie going? He He'll be to... back. He'll be back. He, he wanted to run to the office, so don't worry about oh, where. He was fine. He will have, he'll have fun. So these cars have got a bunch of stuff hiding underneath them that make it go, like the transmission. Mm -hmm. There's four of these electric motors. The electricity is in the <laughs> wire. It comes down the pole. It comes to this big contactor here. When you step on the gold pedal, it closes that, and it starts what they call cutting out the resistance. And you'll see the, the motor starts going. It's just a giant dimmer switch. You can see the light bulb there. It gets brighter and brighter and brighter. That's all it is. So you, you keep going. When you step on the gas pedal, this happens automatically under the car. That was the difference between these cars and the older street cars, the older trolleys, was the fact that now you just got in and you stepped on the gold pedal and it drives just like a truck or a bus does today with an automatic transmission. You step on the gold pedal, you go. Nice, smooth acceleration. You keep going, gets to this point. It's now across the line and it cuts in some more field shunts to make it go a little faster, a little faster, a little faster. If you had the room, which we do not have, you would be going 38 miles an hour. You let off the gas, it sets up the braking circuit. It turns these motors into generators and sends a little bit of electricity to that grid. When you step on the brake pedal, it adjusts the same thing around to adjust how much braking force you're doing by taking the electricity from the motor, sending it to this grid, making heat, brings it down almost to a stop, about two miles an hour, a little drum brake comes on, holds you still until you're ready to go again. What's the fastest the trolley is from? 38. Oh. 11 for you for today. I was <laughs> gonna say how fast is that? Yeah, uh, it's, it's a 28 inch wheel, so you can put a bicycle speedometer on it and come around the corner by Columbus there and put your foot flat down on the floor. When you go past the flags, you're doing 38 miles an hour going, I hope nobody walks out from behind a tree. I hope nobody walks out from behind a tree. The Pokemon. But you guys never get up that fast. No, we don't. The only time we do it, we, we go out around early in the morning, go out and probably go the fastest just to make sure that everything's working right. Is and like when we do a brake test or something. Is that and the button that rings the bell? That is not duplicated on this outfit. Uh, oh, yes, son. Those are, it's not on the old trolleys. Now it's like a lever. It's on old trolleys, you'd step on a, yes. some on the ground. Yes. And on these, it's a, it's a switch that uh, sends, the, uh, sends the signal to the bell. There is an extra one sitting around here somewhere. I don't remember <laughs> where it is, though. Yeah, and it's, while it's we were close to that. And while we were driving around, like a car came in front of the. Oh yeah. Those. I heard I heard the siren, and that's uh, everybody's like, "How come we got sirens on the streetcar?" And it's like, "Well, oh, somebody asked, what did the police think about you having sirens on the streetcar?" And I said, "Well, where do you think we got them? They gave them to us. They did. They did because we have issues with people with the earbuds, and now with the Pokemon and." and stuff and we we need a we can't flinch an inch we can only stop so we need a way to remind people that there are there is a vehicle that's coming down through the grassway we always are very alert and everything and i'm one of the operators too um, we're always very alert all the time but we do have to have a way to wake people up who walk out of a crowd I mean, they will flat walk right. right out of the crowd, right into the side of the car. Has that happened here? Yeah. Really? Yeah, everybody's fine. How upsetting, though, for the driver? Yeah, yeah. Have you yeah. ever accidentally hit a car? Are car. you recording? <laughs> Maybe. No. Yes. Um, Unfortunately, you know, people have run stop signs and... and well, that's what yeah, happened that's today. That's what just happened. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. I mean, he didn't run the stop sign. He took a left and didn't even yeah. look at um, at the trolley. Yeah. Turn that off. Okay. I'm gonna, can I 